Hi children, today's story is Whatever Next. If you've got the story at home, you might want to go and get it so we can go through it together. Can I go to the moon? asked Baby Bear. No, you can't, said Mrs. Bear. It's bath time. Anyway, you'd have to find a rocket first. Baby Bear found a rocket in the cupboard under the stairs. Oh, it's like a big, big box. He found a space helmet on the draining board in the kitchen and a pair of space boots on the mat by the front door. Found a collar in the kitchen and some boots it is going to call space boots by the front door. He packed his teddy and some food for the journey and took off up the chimney. <sighs> Whoosh! Out into the night. Oh my goodness, look at his rocket. How exciting. flew past. That's a smart rocket, he said. Where are you off to? The moon, said Baby Bear. Would you like to come too? Yes, please, said the owl. An aeroplane roared out to the clouds. Baby Bear waved and some of the passengers waved back. I can see them through the windows of the aeroplane waving at the baby bear in his rocket with the owl. On and on they flew, up and up, above the clouds, past millions of stars, till at last they landed on the moon. Here, said Baby Bear. There were no trees, said the owl. It's a bit boring, said Baby Bear. Shall we have a picnic? What a good idea, said the owl. A lovely little picnic there. And Baby Bear brought his teddy bear with him. To go, said Baby Bear. My bath must be ready by now. Off they went, down and down. The owl got out and flew away. Goodbye, he said. It was so nice to meet you. It rained and the rain dripped through Baby Bear's helmet. If you remember, his helmet was a our colony just it's got lots of holes in. So that's how the rain would have got in. Oh my goodness, it's going to be a bit wet. Home went Baby Bear. Back down the chimney and on to the living room carpet with a bump. Gosh, he's crash landed. Look at all the different things he's been having for his picnic. They've come out of the box too. I think he's a bit mucky from that chimney. Mrs. Bear came into the room. Look at the state of you, she gasped, as she led him away to the bathroom. Why, you look as if you'd been down a chimney. His mum doesn't know, does she, of the adventure he's been on. As a matter of fact, said Baby Bear, I have been up the chimney. I found a rocket and went to visit the moon. Mrs. Bear laughed. You in your story, she said. Whatever next? And there's and his mum giving him a good bath and cleaning him all up. He did go on his adventure, didn't he, to the moon? Oh, he's very tired now because of his adventure. I wonder what adventures you could think of that you could go on. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow.